we know like destiny is the creation of our own mind right uh, which is working under the influence of all afflictions afflictions are uh, creating the mind and attachment is, to the afflictions is always very strong so uh, we all have the question why the affliction is uh, don't affect all of us equally why uh, at uh, more places or some places we have some of the afflic afflictions or rather other afflictions have uh, effect on some places and other afflictions are some other places so main yes sudamani uh, ji is al already uh, has uh, declared i mean told the ignorance the vidya is a feeding ground for all the, all, all the afflictions uh, whether it is dormant uh, disjointed active avidya is the breeding ground for all the other four afflictions so uh, see avidya uh, is our unfamiliarity with ourselves yes sudamani ji already mentioned uh, anna, that is unawareness of who we are uh, our true identity uh, we make us believe it makes believe that we are owner of this body mind and senses as well as what we see touch taste and smell and all the sense organs the false sense of self identity is asmita difference between avidya and asmita is very subtle uh, they claim to be atman or the atma Uh, like so when grip of bondage tightens uh, when attachment that is raga and uh, dvesha that is aversions and abhinivesha fear of death joins avidya and asmita the, the, there was really uh, the priority changes and it lead us nowhere uh, in the world which is creating unreality so that is why we are uh, like last two sutras uh, mentioned like uh, about uh, like yogi doing sadhana to practice the practice of we need to practice Uh, to control and get uh, this uh, afflictions by uh, getting more will power determination tapas uh, swadhyaya isar pandidaniya and all the practices which we are doing in uh, kriya yoga uh, and also uh, like uh, isara pranidanadaya is the main thing as someone i think uh, told uh, i think amit to isara pranidanada the stressful surrender uh, we get to know the inner strength and weakness and special privileges of our mind body so it will uh, recognize the power of samskara which is constantly feeding uh, the habit habits and urging us to do getting into the afflictions so this will the isara pranidanada state will uh, have a deeper self study which will fill, fill us uh, more understanding of our self and higher definitely which will guide and protect us so i think uh, main thing is i mean this is the, the uh, like we need to avoid affliction by practicing and uh, i think padanjali also in future sutras he is explaining about pradeep pradeep paksha bhavana that is we no longer subject to mood swings uh, by practicing by identifying the top negative afflictions in our mind right on the top affliction on a daily basis as we are doing suddhi right uh, top negative afflictions uh, needs to be uh, written and we need to replace them with the opposite that is pradipaksha bhavana which is uh, like we need ask us to do extraordinary vigilance have more courage on whatever uh, practice we are doing commitment uh, to eradicate the uh, core main afflictions we have been identified that cause the trigger point for other afflictions so we need to identify the core afflictions that is causing the trigger point for other afflictions so this will make the afflictions very dormant 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 state uh, so afflictions will lose their potency in the dormant stage afflictions become very dead it will become dead because they don't have any capacity to feed our samskaras and the mind is at peace stopping its roaming tendencies so uh, that is what we uh, studied in last uh, samadhi pada right uh, all the uh, all the uh, few last sutras uh, and also he discussed first the nine obstacles initially right uh, nine obstacles uh, which is causing uh, this this afflictions is causing uh, one or one or more of the nine obstacles we studied disease mental inertia doubt clarelessness sloth inability to withdraw our sense bearings inability to reach samadhi inability to retain samadhi and this will also create pain the next sutra of that is giving giving mental agitation and unsteadiness in our limbs and organs and disturbances in inhalation and exhalation process so all these two sutras we studied in samadhi that is these two sutras is is because of this five afflictions so then the last sutra samadhi pada itself uh, he has given how to get out of it but in sadhana pada is getting expanding these afflictions very importantly each one of them 
that is what uh, he, he wants us to do because we, you know, if we are not causing that we are not yet to go into uh, that stage of discussing samadhi uh, om kriya bhavachinamo